now time for your morning rush. Well, after two tries, the United Nations successfully passed a resolution demanding an immediate ceasefire in Gaza. The resolution calls for a ceasefire to last through the Islamic holy month of Ramadan, which ends on Tuesday, April 9th. It also calls for an immediate release of all of the remaining hostages. The vote passed 14-0. Now the United States chose not to vote. All right, well, happening today, Texas Attorney General Ken Paxton is facing a securities fraud case. In the next 12 hours, we could see if he takes a deal that would drop all charges against him. Paxton was indicted on felony charges nearly nine years ago. He is accused of soliciting investors at a McKinney Tech company without disclosing that he was getting paid to promote its stock. His pretrial starts at 9 o'clock in the morning in just a few hours. Now let's turn to some developing news out of the Waco area. A man was just arrested in connection to a deadly crash. Waco police say that 28 year old Ryan Dabney was driving in the single vehicle crash that killed 31 year old Gavin Patrick. This happened on March 13th off East Hearing Avenue in Waco. Waco PD says that Dabney was arrested in Limestone County. Right now he does face intoxication, manslaughter and intoxication assault charges. And that is your morning rush.